We use two different tripods per person. Our film equipment is mounted on the large one, while the small one is used to hold the flowers, grasses, or branches. We often carry the large tripod around with just one hand. It therefore has to be light and stable at the same time. We opted for a carbon crank tripod. Our tripod with the macro rails and the camera weigh a total of six kilograms. With the crank, height differences of approx. 20 cm can be achieved. If an insect crawls from one leaf to the next, you can easily follow it without moving the whole tripod. The tripod should not have horizontal struts between the legs. Struts move too much grass and scare the insect away. In our experience, crank tripods are not suitable for fine adjustment in the millimeter range. There is a slight lateral shift when changing from up to down. In the macro range, this is enough to move the insect out of focus. The extension height of the tripod should be adapted to your own height. On the one hand, you rarely film standing up. On the other hand, you can only recognize insects that are at eye level. An inverted center column, as often recommended by macro photographers, is not suitable because of the video setup. The small travel tripod is used exclusively for attaching the holding clamp for the plants. If you attach the clamp to the film tripod, any vibration during filming will be transferred to the plant and blur the subject. It doesn't matter which travel tripod you use. Some companies offer professional clamps. We have tested a few, all of which were unusable in practice. Expensive is not always good. We have been using our Wimberley Plamp for 19 years now. It was inexpensive and very useful. The clamp can be bent in all directions, adapts to any situation, and reliably holds the flower, small branch, or grass in position. Without this clamp, many of our videos would be blurred. We invested a lot of time and money in cheap macro sleds. Then we overcame our thriftiness and bought the high quality products from NovoFlex. We have been using some of the products for 15 years. Personally, we are simply delighted with NovoFlex products. They are extremely robust and have maintained their precision over the years without any wear and tear. At first glance, our structure appears complicated, elaborate, and heavy. But although it looks adventurous, in practice, it is the best choice for our work. We have mounted a Q equals sign mount on the video head and inserted a QPL 350 coupling plate. A castle cross was attached to the clutch plate and a mini connect system to this in turn. The mini connect system is used to attach the camera quickly and easily. The QPL 350 coupling plate is very important, as you can see here in the picture. It helps us to quickly set the desired distance to the insect or to film on the ground. Here, Elizabeth uses the QPL 350 to roughly adjust the horizontal distance. Sometimes, grass or a small bush prevents you from getting closer with the tripod. Pointing downwards, it ensures the correct distance from the floor. Incidentally, even after 13 years of use, it can be fixed easily and stably with just one turn of the locking screw without any effort. Here the QPL 350 is used to film ants on the ground. By the way, 350 means that the plate has a length of 35 centimeters. The cross slide enables precise fine adjustments sideways and backwards or forwards. The depth of field for macro filming is not set on the camera. We achieve the precise depth of field by setting the exact distance to the insect and using focus peaking in the camera.
If we film downwards to the ground, the weight of the camera pulls downwards and everything rushes towards the ground. With the NovoFlex cross slide, this can be prevented by a locking screw on the side. The screw can be adjusted in any position to prevent the camera from slipping, but importantly, the distance can still be set sensitively and very precisely. The MiniConnect system from NovoFlex is very helpful and well thought out. Simply turn a screw into the camera and it can be clipped in quickly and extremely stably anywhere. Of course, there is also a corresponding belt system. We have been carrying the beanbag around with us for decades. We've used it maybe two or three times. Maybe we could just leave him at home. That's it for today. Until later. Until then.